Hey YouTube, got another video review for you today. Uh, this one is going to be on the Siberian Alpha Series cooler. Um, now I know what you're thinking, does this cooler come with a cart? No, it doesn't. Um, the, the, you have to buy that separately, but I've got another video that I'm going to link to this one. It'll show you all about that cart and just how uh, it fits this uh, Siberian cooler. I just wanted to kind of show it to you because I know a lot of the cooler companies have uh, carts that you can buy through them or separately. And uh, uh, I just wanted to go ahead and show you this one because uh, Siberian doesn't have one that I've seen on their website. But uh, anyways, guys, uh, just follow the link in the description and it'll take you to this cart. And uh, anyways, I want to go ahead and jump into the review on the on the Siberian cooler and let you get a, a look. Uh, this is the Siberian Cooler 60. And I just wanted to show you some of the different features that they have on this cooler that I like. Um, these here are blue. And I think that's pretty sharp looking. And then these are like a gray. And you can see the little latch on this is, it's really heavy duty. It's like it's made out of maybe, I don't know, it feels like metal. I'm not sure if it is or not. But you just pop those up. You don't need two hands to do it. You just pop them up and they just pop up like that. And you know, you've got the cooler. And uh, I really like the cooler. I think it looks really sharp. I like how the Siberian's uh, embossed into the, the lid there. And I really like the, uh, the nice seal here. You can definitely tell that when you open this thing up that it's uh, got a nice um, airtight seal to it. Um, it is a big cooler. It's got plenty of room on the inside. You know, it's a 60 quart. And it does come with a lot of cool features that a lot of the other coolers uh, they have, but you have to buy them separately. Where uh, when you buy the Siberian, uh, it comes with them. And I just wanted to run through those right quick. The first one I wanted to tell you about is uh, it's got a, a wire basket that it comes with. And what this does, it just keeps, uh, like, let's say your sandwiches or uh, some of your other uh, stuff that you want to keep dry uh, out out of the ice and uh, let's say you've got just you want to throw your wallet in there um, that if you're at the beach or something and you know you want to just hide your wallet in there and and if you've got something to uh, lock the, the cooler up to that'd be a good place just to hide your wallet or whatever in there so anyways uh, you, you could hide all your um, belongings in there or, or your food whatever whatever you got to put in there that you don't want to get wet so um, that is a, a nice touch to have that another thing that it comes with is this cutting board it comes with uh, a cutting board and uh, it's also used as like a divider I don't know if you can see how I uh, just put that down in there it fits into the grooves on each side and so you know if you're you know going to use that as a cutting board you could or you could use it as a divider either one or just a place to uh set your food if you're going to do like a picnic or whatever and so uh, you know we basically got a plate right here to use and that comes with it as well they also provide you with this little uh drink holder it's like a little wire uh drink holder that just hooks in to the side right there or anywhere else you could uh find to hook it uh but you know if you're out in your lounge chairs and this cooler's in the middle uh between you and your partner or whatever you could you could put one on this side and uh one on the other side so that is a pretty handy feature as well and last uh this is an another uh product that they they give you when you buy the uh the cooler this is a uh a cooler lock and uh what this does uh, is it slides down um in this little notch in the in the cooler right there and it's got a place here on the other side for you to take and uh, put like a padlock or a piece of chain through there and with a padlock and lock it down to where wherever you're trying to secure it to uh, now I will say that you know uh, this is just uh, it looks like a powder coated steel or whatever and you know if that's that black ever scratches which you know it's going to if you run a padlock in here uh, then you might get a little rust and so uh, I found another company that sells these things that are really really ex inexpensive 
and uh, they're made out of stainless steel so I'll try to put the link uh, to that product in the at the end of the video for you to be able to take a look at that those I think they're like uh, $12 for the stainless steel ones so that's a really good deal uh, now on the Siberian cooler ones it does have a built-in uh, bottle opener but to me um, I don't know that I really care for that because um, if somebody come through here with a uh, um let's say a sawzall it wouldn't take them long at all to saw through this right here and then come up a little ways and saw through this and then they could get that lock right off there so um yeah it's a nice touch putting the bottle opener on there but it really it doesn't provide a whole lot of security now i know what you're gonna say yeah uh, a thief can get into anything and that's true so um but for me um uh, i want to have something that's a little bit stronger than this you know especially if i'm gonna go put a, a big old piece of chain and a padlock on there i don't want them to say oh man there's a weak spot right there and i can get in so but i will say that uh siberian does offer a lot of accessories for the money uh none of your other coolers that i know of offers um so many like accessories that comes with it that i just showed you so that is a big plus one thing that I would like uh, Siberian to do on their next uh, line of coolers is um, to add a place to uh, lock the lid. So let's say I've got this uh, cooler uh, chained down to my kayak trailer through uh, this little locking, uh, this little bracket right here where you put a, a padlock and a piece of chain and you're, you're affixing it to uh let's say your truck bed or your your kayak trailer or whatever you you're using it on um anybody could still uh get in the cooler and open it up and steal all your drinks and hell if you got food in there you know they could they could easily get into it and uh i know my myself i've owned several of these uh rotomoted cool coolers before and um some of the ones that i've looked at has like a little area right in this this section and um it has like a little notch in it and uh it has like a a stainless steel tab uh and what i'm referring to if, if you look at like the vibe cooler i believe it's the element 20 um that's the one i'm referring to it has like a little notch right in here and it allows you to have a, a, a stainless steel area to uh open your bottles because it has like a bottle opener but then it has a little hole in it as well so you could take and put a padlock right here and uh keep people from getting in into your cooler if you're not around the cooler so you know i, I would like to see them do that um but i tell you for the money it's hard to beat this cooler it is not made in the usa i will say that it i, I wished it was i wish they would uh uh make this one here in the u.s that would that would make me a lot a lot more happy about this cooler but uh anyways uh let me flip this thing over and i'll show you what the the bottom of the feet look like all right guys i got the cooler laying on its back and uh one thing that you you'll notice is uh this is like a little a rubber foot on there and this one is uh is more of a a, a, a grippy type of sticky foot and you can pull this uh, stainless steel bolt out which yes this is this is stainless steel i know for a fact because i buy a lot of stainless um all the time and i just recognize it uh, but you can pull this bolt out and flip the uh the foot over and it's got like a a more uh slick harder uh easy to slide type of foot on the bottom of it but for me you know i, I want the uh, non-slip on this one because i don't want it sliding around uh, all over that cart so uh, I'm just gonna keep these on there but uh, you can see what the the bottom of it looks like and so you know for the money uh, I don't think you can beat this cooler I really don't think that you can beat this cooler because uh, you know it is a 60 quart um, and you know it, it's it's very well made 
um, I'm not going to get into ice retention because there's like a dozen other videos on ice retention and all that. I just wanted to kind of give you an up close and personal look at this cooler and some of the features I like and some of the ones that I don't. And, uh, you know, just tell it like it is. And so, like I said, I think this cooler is great for the money and it does come with a lot of features. And, you know, uh, I, I wanted to tell you that uh, this is just a sticker on the front here. Uh, I left it on till I, I do the review, but you can see, I'm going to go ahead and pull it off. Kind of give you an idea of what it looks like without this Alpha Series uh, sticker on there. And plus, whenever you get yours, after you see this video, you'll know that uh, pulling this sticker off won't leave a bunch of sticky residue. I know a lot of times when I pull stickers off stuff, I spend the next hour scratching the uh, the sticky mess that it leaves behind. But uh, yeah, you can see it's a nice looking cooler. And uh, you know, check out their website. They have a lot of different coolers, different size coolers. They do have some uh, soft coolers. And uh, I'll be reviewing one of those next. I've got, uh, I've got one of those coming out. So make sure you... Uh, like and subscribe to my channel because I've got a bunch more cooler reviews coming up. Uh, I'm going to be reviewing the uh, Creek Cooler and the uh, and the, the Creek Cooler is the one that floats behind your kayak or or you can put it in a swimming pool or whatever. But uh, that review is coming up, and then I've got the Hydro Caddy. Uh, it's a cooler slash uh, dry storage area for like a kayak or whatever. Um, I've got a uh, uh, I've got a couple other videos of coolers coming out. Just bear with me, and uh, they'll be popping up here in the next few weeks. But uh, please like and subscribe to my channel. And if I run across any problems with this cooler, I will definitely, definitely let you know. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video.